What's up? See you later. Good morning. Good morning. You ready? Yes. So ready. I'm excited. Also, I'm a little bit nervous. It's 7.29 a.m. in the morning and I'm like uber excited. Like so excited. Oh my god, I can't even explain it. Because today I get my first ever American CrossFit experience. So, I've only ever been to UK boxes, been here for three days. Today, I've got a subscriber that's actually offered to pick me up, and he's just right there. And his name is Koshe. Say hey. Hey! <laughs> what up? This is so cool. That was a lot higher to get out than I thought. Yes. You're a nano man. I like the nanos. Yeah, I got like way too many pairs though. Okay, so my first box experience is going to be at a place called Paradiso CrossFit, which is literally like 30 seconds down the road from Gold's Gym. I passed Gold's Gym and I was like, whoa! Because you know, you see it everywhere. Here we are. Over here. Hey, how are you? Good. You okay? Actually. Nice to meet you, Craig. Hey, hey man, how's it going? Josh. <laughs> <laughs> I like dogs. There is a box dog and it's called Matzo Ball. What up, dude? <laughs> what? We'll just retake <laughs> You know you're at a pretty mega gym that have been to the CrossFit Games and whatnot. When you look at the benchmark girls board, and a friend time is 205, 217, 218. When Grace is completed in 109 and 127. When Isabel is done in 113, 119, and 144. And someone in Cindy's got like 25 rounds. Some athletes are just mind blowing. I've just seen the workout and it's definitely a welcome to America workout. Apparently Saturdays are their partner workouts like back at home. And Sundays are their long 45 minute Metcon, it's just, just work. So that is what we're gonna do. It's absolutely surreal being in Venice, doing a CrossFit workout at a CrossFit box. I said this to John yesterday, doing YouTube, you kind of never know where you're gonna end up. You just start and then, I'm like here. <laughs> Mental. I said it was a long one. Oh, hello. <laughs> Hi. 800 meter run, 50 burpees, 400 meter run, 50 jumping barbell squats, 200 meter run, 100 dumbbell snatches at 45 pounds. Then we go back up, so we go 200 meter run, 50 jumping barbell squats, 400 meter run, 50 burpees, 800 meter run to finish. Good job, I love running. I don't love running. Are you excited? <laughs> yeah, I'm excited. I, I, man, I love training. I live to train. So one, one loop around the entire block. Nice. It's gonna be fun. You're gonna love this. You, you looking forward to it? I'm. Like, yeah, somewhat. Yeah, same. We'll see after this 800. <laughs> <laughs> hey. See, I told you we were right by Gold's Gym. Mental torture. Ah. You pushed me in that last bit. I was trying to. I was like, I was like ah. <laughs> Enjoy that? Enjoyed that. Yeah, did you? I uh, I did actually. It was quite a good day on a Sunday. What more can you do in SoCal, right? Oh, dude, the heat. 
coming from yeah. coming from the UK where it's like minus one to this. Yeah. Jeez. Tell me it's gonna be this hot. Hey, we don't quit. We don't quit. <laughs> we just have to enjoy it, you know. Halfway through the final lot of burpees, John turned to me when I was like dying and he was like, Craig, we don't quit. And I was like, yes. Keep nailing them. Finally done with that workout. 36.29 was my time. What was you? 34.20. Oh, thanks for cheering for me. Pounding. John. John. <laughs> John, it's a dog. I like talking to dogs. That workout was, it was nothing other than mental. Yeah. Period. You're so right, man. CrossFit is a lot of mental game. Your, your head is going to give out before your body does. And if you can just keep putting yourself back down on the floor, if you just keep putting one foot in front of the other when you run, especially when you first finish an exercise and you're like gassed, just keep your feet moving, you'll kind of ease into the run. It's the same with like most exercises, apart from when you go heavy, obviously. <laughs> I haven't sweated this much in probably forever. But it feels so good, so freaking good. Paradiso CrossFit, 10 out of 10. Freaking loved it. Dude, I like your car. No, it's super sweet, right? What is oh, this? That's LA, bro. Yeah. Dude, that is... That's someone's house. Is that's that? somebody's house. Yeah. That is huge. What you, do, what you do is you park it for a couple days, and then you gotta move it. Keep and moving. Then you gotta move that it. That is so American. It is. Yeah, they're very Sorry, cool. I just literally oh. like went, no, no, went no, to him. Cool. I was like, stop the car. Look how cool that is. <laughs> I was like, is there... I thought one of the dogs I know, one right? of us were made. <laughs> Wow. British people. So American. <laughs> Damn British people. You know, it's so mainstream now. It's kind of like, eh, this is the famous Tower 26. Okay. So Tower 26 is where the who's who of the endurance swimming world, they all start at this tower and either swim a mile, two miles north or a mile. Koshe said when we're down in Venice, he has to take us to the beach and I've been wanting to go to the beach the whole entire time. It's so like, I'm totally like, I'm lost for words how like, someone like Koshe can literally just send us an inbox and be like, look, I saw your videos, I just want to take you around. Like, you don't have to do that. And, dude. It's awesome, man. Yeah, this beach is insane at night it lights up and then obviously the santa monica mountains and when pokemon go was going off that was like yeah <laughs> well, i used to it play that crazy. game non-stop me too man me too <laughs> wow and if you yes i'm on the beach this is what the community is all about with crossfit like crochet is the definition of the community You're saying that's cold? I say what? You're saying this is cold? <laughs> Dude, when this you is go warm! There, it's still, yeah. <sighs> they were saying that it was super cold because it comes from Alaskan water, but like, for the UK, that's, a, that's, a, that's warm water. We needed one of these. We got the expo to go to still. Yeah. 105.9 radio station, incredible. Every tune so far has been a banger. Would you rather be strong or look strong? Be strong. If you were an ice cream flavor, which flavor ice cream would you be? Um, peanut butter. I hate peanut butter. Oh! McDonald's or Burger King? Oh, Burger King. They have a vegan burger now. Burger King is better because their fries are better. Name the first word that comes into your head right now. Airplane. That's sick, dude. I don't know. What color is your toothbrush? Um, bamboo color. <laughs> no way! Yeah. If you could be a superhero, which one would you be? Batman. And the reason why? It's just because he's actually badass without any superpowers. Your favorite movie? Spider-Man. OG Spider-Man. Let that simmer for a second. If you could be stuck in the lift with one celebrity, who would it be? Will Ferrell. 
Because we could do, do karate in the garage. <laughs> in the lift. In the lift. Yeah. That works too. <laughs> Would you rather lose an eye or lose a hand? Lose a hand. Would you rather live without coffee or your laptop? Lap uh, coffee. Carbs or coffee? Carbs. Carbs all the way and coffee. Yeah, but you don't have one. Oh, carbs, for sure. Carbs. <laughs> Okay, so we're home. <laughs> Jesus. <laughs> Scared the s*** out of me. Um, we're just vibing and editing. Like There's some vibing music on, some people are cooking. John, Meg, editing, I'm editing. And yeah, I went for like the total American experience. So we were walking around the LA Fair Expo and I was like, you know what? I just want to kind of like walk off. And so I just walked off, walked around the LA a little bit and then ended up in... What was the place called? Ended up in Tom's Urban and I literally just went, I got a pint. <laughs> and watched the American football. The game was the New York Giants versus the Green Bay Packers, and I literally had no clue what was going on. <laughs> I just sat there and just enjoyed the atmosphere. But the house is just chilling. Hey. Hey. See, just literally just chilling. Right? Yami's boyfriend is huge. <laughs> Only because I'm close it Makes to me the look camera. like a dwarf. No, I'm even closer to the camera than you are, and you, you still look huge. Eat your vegetables. Yeah, I know, tell me about it. And Meg put us in our video yesterday, which was super cool. You guys are the stars. Wait, 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 wait. you can't hit the video yet. We have to wait for our food. Yeah, you have to see your food, first time. Huh? I never responded. Yeah, yeah. Much better. better. Yeah. Now, what do we get? Poke. So what poke is, is basically it's, it's raw, f it's very similar to sushi. The way that I explain it is it's basically like sushi in a bowl. Nailed it. <laughs> a lot of you may know Jack, who is one of my good friends, tatted huge, is like the judge in CrossFit in many places that we have been. He has asked me to shout out his girlfriend who is turning 30 today, I think it is, and to get everyone to say happy birthday. Happy birthday, Lucy. Happy birthday, Lucy. Hey, Lucy. I just want to say happy birthday from the YouTube house. Lucy? Happy birthday, buddy. I love you so much. Happy birthday, Lucy. Happy birthday, Lucy. Lucy, my dear, congrats on turning one year older. Congrats to... He's a little quiet. Happy birthday, Lucy. Happy birthday, Lucy! <laughs> And on that note, I'm going to end the video. Obviously, if you, obviously, guys, if you did enjoy it, then please do smash that like button. It really, really does help the channel go that little bit further. And yeah, we'll see you in tomorrow's video, which is, if it's anything like today, it's going to be epic. Catch you in the next one. Nailed it. Is that right? Yep. Perfect. It is now. I was like, uh, we're warming up because we have got a hell of a lot of running to do today. I was like, oh, I'm gonna try the true form runner because I've never been on one before. And it feels so surreal. Hold on, I'll try it. It feels so surreal. Like, I wanna see your reaction because this. I go fast. I don't know how you like keep it. Oh, here we go, here we go. It feels really, really nice when you get into the rhythm of it. <laughs> it's like, it's like, I'm so surprised. Mm -hmm. Like, that's so weird. That's my first time ever on a true form runner. Here in, uh, here in Venice. <laughs>